is now found in 80% of the foods we eat. But with the constant confusion over its effects on our health, and with this little person on the way, I feel like I need some definitive answers. The point is to test out a very high sugar diet. How are you going to do that? If you want to match averages, 40 teaspoons of sugar a day. 40 a day. But they must be hidden sugars found in commonly perceived healthy foods and drinks. So no soft drink, confectionery or ice cream. People on this planet are growing sicker every day. And many scientists now believe that fructose has a role to play. I'm eating the same amount of calories as I did before and I'm not feeling full. These calories do dramatically different things on the human body. If I kept going to these levels, would I be knocking on the door of obesity? Definitely. You haven't got far to go. Any sugar, brown sugar, white sugar, fruit juice concentrate from fruit juice, equal effect on your health. Not feeling very well at all today. My fuse is a lot shorter. Your mental function is just unstable. You've got the signs of a fatty liver. This is the first time I've seen that it can be developed in two or three weeks. <laughs> Whenever you walk into a supermarket, make an immediate turn for the produce aisle and avoid everything in the middle. Sugar's not evil. But life is so much better when you get rid of it. Hey, I'm Lisa. Now, Black Hawk Down and Infection screenwriter Ken Nolan is writing a film adaptation of Image Comics The Activity. And according to a new rumour, Marvel is eyeing Angelina Jolie to helm its first female-led film, Captain Marvel. After being impressed by Jolie's work on Unbroken, Marvel is offering her, wait for it, 20 million to direct Captain Marvel. Now, don't forget to download our Film Is Now app for instant access to all our trailers.